Why are self and init needed, and what are their roles? Have a look at this code. We've got a class and a method defined within it. And at the end, we've created an instance of this same class. We set an attribute to the instance and call the method like this. It prints a message. But why do we need this self in the method here? In Python, self is not a keyword but a convention. It refers to the current instance of the class. When we call an instance method like this, Python does something behind the scenes. It automatically passes the instance as the first argument to the method. This means self in the method is essentially this variable. In our example, we added a name attribute to p dynamically, and self.name lets the method access it. Without self, Python wouldn't know which object's name to look at. We know Python is super flexible, so we can just keep adding attributes to objects on the fly like this. We just added two new attributes to p without changing the class. But while this works, it can get messy really quickly. Imagine if we had to manually add five or 10 attributes every time we created an object. This is where the init method saves us. It handles all the setup for us. It's a special method that runs automatically when we create an instance. We pass the attributes as arguments, and init does the rest. Check the i button or find the link in the description to watch the dedicated video on the init method. With the init method, there's a lot we can do. First, it keeps our code clean. Second, it makes sure all our objects are properly initialized. And third, we can add cool things like default values or even input validation. See, if we don't pass an age, it just defaults to 30. And if you want to make sure inputs are valid, you can even add checks. Now, if we try something silly like this, Python wouldn't allow it and raises an error. So, in short, self ties methods to the instance, letting them access attributes. And in it gives us a structured, automatic way to set up those attributes when the object is created. Together, they make our code cleaner and way easier to manage. I guess it cleared up about self and init in Python. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next one.